Oh, hey, what's up, Internet and Internet people? I'm going to try to talk very clearly and precise because I am recording a video. And this is a test video. Um, I was messing around in the settings. Uh, I shouldn't say a lot because that's going to mess everything up. But I was messing around in the settings and open camera has a feature where you can record subtitles in real time. I don't know how well this feature works, and this is the test video. I will take the subtitle track and upload it and see how much of a joke trying to record subtitles while recording a video in real time actually is. So, uh, all those awkward pauses isn't going to help any, and I should just talk fluently and like if I was talking to another person. But sometimes that is hard to pull off in a video, especially if it's unscripted and I don't have like, you know, anything to read from. I'm looking at the road. I shouldn't say stuff weird like that, you know, road. <laughs> People drive so crazy. Um, Any hoots. So I wanted to talk about a couple little things. I mentioned in my last rant that Daily Motion was canceling my live feed. I read a couple articles, and I guess Daily Motion got taken over by a bigger Netflix-like company. Um, like Net Netflix for Paris or where wherever type company. I don't remember the name. It started with a V. That's going to be well uh, dictated. <laughs> so anyways, this is just a test. I just wanted to see. I wonder if I can just edit the subtitles and just be like mumbling. And if that's good enough for... So I'm trying to kill two birds with one stone. And I it's hard. It's hard to talk and try to dictate at the same time. But, um, if you remember my other rant about Amazon, this is the reason why I'm trying to dictate very clearly and precisely what I'm saying so the dictation works. It's kind of a bunch of dicks in this, this uh, video. But, um, anywho, anywho, gotta use proper grammar as well, because <laughs> it doesn't know slang, it doesn't know how to, you know, pick up all the, the slang words you say, and whatnot. Like, whatnot, it's probably not a good word to use, but it might, it might realize, hey, he said whatnot. I don't know. So this is, this is why I'm testing all this stuff out, and... I know that it can't understand mumbled or you know, slurred speech, so this probably wouldn't be a good alternative to making drunk videos. Drunk videos. Just want to see what it's picking up and what's not. Um, so if I repeat myself or it sounds stupid, what I say, there is reason, maybe. Anywho. I mean, anyways, um, gotta stop saying the ums and the uh, and the there's, there's no way it's gonna know what the hell that is. That's besides the point. Alrighty, I did it again. It just, it just happens sometimes. It just naturally flows. So I was looking at a couple things today. This article that's like, oh yeah, Daily Motion got bought out by some other Netflix like Paris company. And the guy was like, Yeah, I'm gonna change up everything. They started by removing, you know, all the, the porn on Daily Motion. If you guys didn't know, there's an age gate on there and it allowed users to uh, pretty much upload whatever and there's a lot of piracy on on Daily Motion, and they started cleaning that up. And the second thing 
that he wanted to do is be more of a Netflix or whatever. So they they already they I guess they did this earlier this year. They they sent me an app uh, to beta test their app, and I noticed there was no upload button anymore. There was no like you know make a video real quick because there's a reason for that. They they're trying to get rid of their user generated content so that's a thing they're trying to just do the the mainstream and be more like tv or whatever uh the mainstream publications and whatnot so after learning that i was like oh yeah this makes sense now that uh i understand where the direction of the company's going and what they're all doing so youtube's trying to do the same thing they just haven't announced it yet but they're all trying to be, as TV's trying to be more and more like them, uh, the old media is trying to be like new media. The new media, which was new anyways, maybe 10, 10 years ago, the new media, or the middle-aged media, is trying to be like the old media. So everybody's trying to copy each other, and the grass is always greener, as they say. Some may say the grass is that's a, a saying here in the uh, America is the grass is always greener, and we'll see how true that is because everyone's trying to be what they're not. And you know, if you start a company with user-generated content, and you want to get into something else. Maybe you should start a new website. Um, just saying, that's the thing. There, you can make more than one website, and if you want to, you know, call it uh, Daily Motion Red. There's, there's a free one for you. You can take that. I did not copyright it. Is it just call it Daily Motion Red and uh, put the, the, the better content of what you think is better. Um, the old TV stuff on there and or maybe call it daily motion TV that's a that's not that has been taken I'm sure so make it make it daily motion TV you know don't mess with my live feed though uh, not that here's the thing I here's a secret internet I didn't really use I shouldn't whisper because it's trying to dictate this sun is right in my eyeballs by the way um, I didn't really use the live feature. I used it like three times. And uh, I can't see anything. Um, so it's not a big loss to me, but I'm afraid what's going to happen next. What else are they gonna strip away from the user, uh, the, you know, the content creators and whatnot. And I, as I said before, I am partnered with them. So, that's a thing too. Uh, the sun is so in my eyeballs. It's so awkward. Um, what else did I want to talk about? Okay, so on VidMe, I found I looked at like the top twenty best creators or whatever, just to, to see you know the pecking order around there, see what was really like, really going on with the the pecking order. And I noticed a couple of weird things. That one of the most viewed channels in VidMe history is a channel that's just uploading um, other people's content. And I was like, how is this? How do they? How are they getting away with this? If you want to check out the channel uh, or report them or whatever, I didn't report them because I'm not a snitch. I don't do all that snitching. Um, I did do some snitching though. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. There was, uh, when it comes to like just putting up porn, yeah, I'm a snitch. Uh, man, that sun was really bothering my eyeballs. <laughs> and I have to go, it only happens when I go is that west. Yeah, west. So I have to go west more, so that's gonna suck. Uh, give my eyeballs a break for a minute here. Why is it telling me to slow down? Speed limit 
it's 45. I think it's blinking. It's like, oh, you're going fast. No, I'm not. 40 isn't nearly 45. Alrighty, hoots. Uh, this is going to be a, a good ramble. I feel bad for any kind of dictation software that's trying to pick this up. So, I started off like, oh, trying to talk proper, but now I'm just like, whatever. Uh, so <laughs> maybe I'll just cut the first five minutes and then see, see, uh, okay, but I don't know. Whatever. Now I just start mumbling and gurgling as noises to try to talk, but, um, 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 get that out of my system. What was I talking about again? <laughs> oh yeah, daily motion. So yeah, that, I, don't, I don't see that. If the company keeps on going in this direction, uh, maybe we'll see the death of daily motion before the death of YouTube. Which is sad, because I did have I did have high hopes for the website uh, wanted it to succeed. Uh, other, you know, content creators would tell me, yeah, it's dead. No one goes there. No one does anything there. But there's still that hope that, you know, all it takes is a lot of people to migrate over there. And then it could be thriving. But if they're making it hard for people to upload and create content creators to actually use their site, then... It's gonna not do well. So, anywho, it's that that's a thing now. Um, but they haven't been doing well in the last, uh, I guess, ever since the buyout. And I didn't really even know this about the buyout. But no one likes the new changes. I guess I don't know. I see. There's no community really there. It's that's the that's the problem. And since there's no community, I don't know if people are liking this or not not liking this. And it's just hard to, to gauge. I had to read news articles to, to even find out what was going on over there. And I don't know if they're biased or not biased or what. But we'll see. Uh, I got my eyes on what's going on now in Daily Motion Land. We'll see uh, how it works out over there. And another thing, uh, saying a bunch of things like daily motion over and over again, I don't know how well it's going to pick up on uh, the dictation, but that's what this video is for. Anywho, oh, I did it again. When you're not trying to do it, that's when I do it the most. Is when, like, yeah, I'm just not going to say that, that thing, and then I just keep on saying it. It's like a bad transition. It's like it is a bad transition. It's horrible, and I need to get out of the habit of doing it. Especially in my rants, there's probably a hundred billion and 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 uh, 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 blah, you know, just garbage talk coming out of my mouth. But that, that's the easiest way for me to get all my thoughts out it's through ranting and. The whatnot. Um, I don't have to rant forever. This could have ended, you know, 14 minutes ago or so. And this was just a really quick test, but it just turned into a, a thing. So, yeah, if you want to check out that VidMe channel, I don't mention, I don't know if I mentioned the name, and if you want to flag it, go for it. I'm not going to do it. Um, I actually enjoyed a couple of the videos that were uploaded. And I wouldn't have seen them otherwise. But if you want to flag them, shout, shout out to... Oh, by the way, I am going to be doing more shout out videos. Yes, so I look forward to that. I'm going to have a whole album created for just shout out videos. Um, actually, if any of the VidMe staff watch this, I recommend you have a whole category... You know, just for shoutouts because they're they're becoming more and more popular. 
on your site. I know creators are trying to help other creators. Some creators are like, you know, give me a dollar and I'll give you a shout out or give me a tip and I'll give you whatever. Like people gotta eat. So <laughs> if you really need a shout out from, you know, creator X or whatever, then I'm sure it's worth a dollar to you. Any hoots, uh any hoots. I did it again. Um so yeah, I'm gonna look forward to more shout out videos. Uh I'll try to make them as entertaining as I can. I'm just gonna be plugging other people to go watch. I'm like, oh, don't watch this. Go watch something else. <laughs> that misdirection, you know. Um, I said, um, I said, um. So that's the thing that's gonna happen. I never told you the the thing, the the vid me most viewed, but you'll figure it out. Like, there's a couple of them that are just re-uploading other people's videos. But, uh, don't let, you know, don't get caught in the cookie jar too many times. Um, The Real Obama, if you want to go check out their channel. So, shout out to The Real Obama. Stop stealing other people's videos. I don't know if you're getting permission to do that, but you should be because... Otherwise, you're just stealing other people's videos, and I don't know if you're profiting from it, but if you are, it's pretty shady. Um, I'm guessing you are. I did see ads on the videos, so that's pulling in some kind of revenue when you get to numbers that big. As I said, it's one of the most viewed Vid me, and I, there's nobody subscribed, but it's the one of the most viewed. Like some of the the videos I looked at had, were pretty new and had three thousand, three thousand um, shares, like over three thousand shares. So it's been put out there quite some time, like quite a bit. I don't know where these shares are coming from. That would be interesting see the analytics of where the the videos are being shared so you can see how they're getting the, the crazy views that they're getting but um either way it's not like important here or there um any new site's gonna have like people that are trying to abuse the system and make a quick buck but it's kind of shady when you know, just go check out the channel. It's pretty shady. I'm not trying to cause, like, you know, vid me drama or anything like that. But even the name is, like, I don't know, the real Obama. And it's not Obama's channel or anything. They have, I don't know if they're verified or not. I'll have to investigate more. Because I did look at the channel, but I didn't really, like... Super sniff it or out oh, there's that sign. All right, peace out. Oh, I forgot that uh, <laughs> I had to unlock my video to turn it.